Whenever it comes to towing your trailer and you get that annoying hip slap, like just ka-chunka-chunka -chunka going down the road, you got your trailer hooked up, you're ready for a great vacation, and this is all you're here for hours, that's enough to stress everybody out in the vehicle. And right now I'm going to show you a few ways to keep that from happening. Now, uh, some of them, you know, people have been using like B&W Trailer Hitches has this silencer pad. They use that. It does work. It does do a pretty good job. But uh, a lot of people like to resort to the old faithful duct tape. They just say duck it, they throw a few wraps on it, but the problem with that is, is it wears out and then eventually you're slowly going to get that back. And you know when it's going to come back? When you're on an eight hour road trip with your wife and she's going to be flipping out because she hears this the whole way. So what I found is I got these silent hitch pins and uh, they're from Arrow. And I'm going to put a link here to go to Amazon. You can go and check these things out. These things are awesome awesome whenever it comes to silencing that annoying hitch slap and this one here is a two inch and uh this one retails for 35.99 on amazon and then this one is a two and a half inch and this one retails for 38.95 on amazon and i'm going to install these real quick and show you how they work because you're not even going to believe how easy it is and how much it silences that hitch slap First thing you're going to want to do is make sure that your hitch matches the receiver on your tow vehicle. Now, you'll notice that this is a two and a half inch shank. This is a two and a half inch receiver. And what happens a lot of times is whenever you buy a vehicle, like this is a Ram 3500 dually, and it comes with an adapter to break that two and a half inch down to two inch. So then what happens is when you stick a two inch hitch in there, you've got a whole bunch of clanging and slamming and banging, and it's totally unnecessary, and it's just not the way it should be. So what you want to do is you want to get rid of this adapter and you want to make sure that you get a hitch that is perfect for the uh, size on your receiver so there you go two and a half inch receiver two and a half inch shank it's a perfect fit but when you're going down the road you still have that so what we're going to do is we're going to install our two and a half inch uh, silent hitch pin and we're going to take that slap right out all right so when we open this up here take a look at this The one thing about this is the installation is pretty easy. The instructions are simple. I mean, it's just not very difficult. It only takes you a couple minutes to put this thing in. Probably the hardest part of it is when you put your plate and spring in your uh, hitch. But we're going to show you how that works. All right. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to take this apart. One thing you want to make sure uh, you do not do which I did on the first one is uh, Pull this spring out of this block. It's not in there by very much. You can see that they just crimp it in there uh, That's not in there by very much and it's basically just enough to get it in your hitch and uh, That's about it So what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, compress this spring on this block and we're gonna put it inside of our hitch and We're just gonna go like this right here and we're going to slide it right in just like that right there you see that and we're going to take it into the first hole line that spring up insert it here into the receiver and we're going to go in right to where that hole stops and then what we'll do is we'll take this uh, piece here and we'll just insert it right in there and just start threading it in Take it into where it hits the lock washer. And then what you can do is you can just take a 16 millimeter and just get it in there, tighten it up nice and snug. And then according to the instructions, you're gonna take your torque wrench and you're gonna torque it to 35 foot pounds, just like that, and you're good to go. So then all you do is you insert that, you insert your locking mechanism and now this is locked to your vehicle and nobody can take it off nobody can steal your hitch and that my friends is how you keep the hitch slap from happening so check it out we got an amazon link here you can go there and get whichever one you need a two inch or two and a half inch but i'm telling you if you've got that annoying hitch slap this here silent hitch pin from arrow will definitely take care of all your problems